In the last video, we looked at different types of pulleys and how to find their direction of rotation. In this video, we will take a look at the speed of rotation. Finding the speed of rotation is very similar to the speed of rotation with gears. The only difference is now we will be using the pulley diameter instead of the number of teeth on the gear. This means that our driven RPM is equal to the driver RPM multiplied by the ratio of the driver diameter over driven diameter. We will multiply by this ratio of the driver diameter to the driven diameter for each belt. Let's take a look at an example. We want to find the angular speed of pulley B. Pulley A has a diameter of 5 inches and it is rotating at 1000 revolutions per minute. The diameter of pulley B is 20 inches. We can keep the diameters in inches since they are both in inches and dividing inches by inches cancels out those units. The speed of B is equal to the speed of A multiplied by the diameter of A divided by the diameter of B. We can then substitute in our values for speed and diameter, so we have 1000 RPM multiplied by 5 inches divided by 20 inches. This means that the speed of pulley B is 250 RPM. This makes sense since the diameter of B is 4 times larger than the diameter of A, so it should be spinning 1 quarter as fast. Let's take a look at one last example. We want to find the angular speed of pulley D, which has a diameter of 15 inches. We know that pulley A has a diameter of 5 inches and it is spinning at 1000 RPM. We have two other pulleys, pulley B with a diameter of 20 inches and pulley C with a diameter of 10 inches. First, let's set up what we will need to multiply. The speed of pulley D is equal to the speed of pulley A multiplied by the diameter ratios for each belt. So we have to multiply the speed of pulley A by the ratio of the diameter of A to the diameter of B since they are connected by the same belt and then we multiply by the diameter pulley C divided by pulley D since they are also connected by a different belt. Substituting in our values, the speed of A is 1000 RPM and we multiply that by the ratio of 5 inches to 20 inches and multiply that by the ratio of 10 inches to 15 inches. When we punch that into our calculators, we see that the speed of pulley D is around 167 RPM. This concludes our seven part video series on gears and pulleys.